Hello everyone, welcome to Med Smashers. Today I am gonna discuss about retinoblastoma. It is a very important topic in ophthalmology. The definition is malignant tumor of retina arising from embryonal neuronal cell of retina. It is a very serious condition because within 3 years child may die. The aim is not to save the eyeball. The aim is to save the life of the patient. Here is a picture of healthy eye. Right side there is a picture of retinoblastoma. You can see the tumor. The clinical features. Age less than 3 years found only in children. Boys predominance. It is an autosomal dominant disorder. Genetic inheritance. The gene is called RB13Q14. It may be uniocular or binocular. Now the symptoms. The only symptoms you can see is leukocoria, which means white pupillary reflex or amoretic cat's eye reflex, which is first noticed by the mother. You can see the picture here. The pupil has become white. Signs. Nystagmus means involuntary oscillatory movement of eyeball squint high intraocular pressure signs of iritis hypopion differential diagnosis or causes of leukocoria in children the causes are retinoblastoma congenital cataract endophthalmitis coarse disease toxocara persistent hyperplastic primary vitreous and retinopathy of prematurity. In adult, the causes are age-related cataract, endophthalmitis, vitreous opacity. Types of retinoblastoma. There are two types. Endophytic retinoblastoma and exophytic retinoblastoma. Endophytic retinoblastoma where tumor grows inside the eyeball and in exophytic retinoblastoma the tumor grows outwards. Spreading of retinoblastoma, there may be direct lymphatic or by blood stream. Direct into intraocular tissue or into extraocular tissue. Extension into central nervous system via optic nerve. Extension into orbit as fungating mass. Lymphatic spread along with orbital lymphatic into preauricular and cervical lymph node. By blood stream, choroidal invasion, it is the main route. Common sites are bones, liver and lungs. Examinations and investigations. Examination of retina under general anesthesia with dilated pupil of both eyes by direct and indirect ophthalmoscopy. Then beta scan ultrasonogram of both eye. Here you can see globular shadow coming from retina and CT scan is also helpful. Stages of retinoblastoma It is very important. Frequently the professors ask this question. Stage 1 Quiescent stage Tumor is small and no other symptoms. Stage 2 Glucomatous stage Intraocular pressure is increased here and the tumor is large. Stage 3 Extraocular extensions Tumor extends outside the eye but limited within the orbit. Stage 4 Distant metastasis Commonest route is through optic nerve into cranial cavity. Also goes to long bones and lungs. Treatment of retinoblastoma According to stage, stage 1 if the tumor is small, laser photocoagulation and cryotherapy is provided. Stage 1 if the tumor is large and stage 2 enucleation. Stage 3 accentuation. Stage 4 chemotherapy and radiotherapy. If tumor in both eyes, then if tumors are small, tumor removal of one eye and in another eye chemotherapy and radiotherapy. If tumors are large, both eyes are removed. Destructive operations of eyeball. Annucleation, aviscaration, excentration. 
I will discuss about these three operations now. Enucleation. It is the surgical removal of eyeball by cutting the extraocular muscles and optic nerve with its meninges. The whole eye is then removed. Artificial eye is used so it is cosmetically better. Here you can see the picture of enucleation right side. The extracular muscle and optic nerve with its meninges is cut. Indications of enucleation and there is absolute and relative indications. Absolute indications are stage 1 large tumor, stage 2 retinoblastoma, malignant melanoma, road traffic accident. Relative indications are endophthalmitis if not respond medically, thysis bulby with calcification. Contraindication is panophthalmitis. It means the inflammation of all course of eye including intraocular structure. It is contraindicated because infection is spread via cut ends of optic nerve sheath cause meningitis. Abyscaration. It is the surgical removal of intraocular contents along with inner two course retaining clearer shell and optic nerve. Here you can see the picture in the left side abyscaration. Intraocular contents are removed with inner two coats. The indications of abyscaration are panophthalmitis, endophthalmitis, expulsive hemorrhage. Now excentration. It is the removal of eyeball, all the orbital contents along with the periosteum of orbit and eyelid. Here you can see a picture and the indications are stage 3 retinoblastoma orbital tumors prone to metastasize which is malignant melanoma. This is all about retinoblastoma. I hope you have liked this lecture. I have an Instagram account. I will put the link in the description box. If you like this video then give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And also hit the bell button for more notifications. Thank you everyone. Bye.